Hey guys, what is going on? This is King Mall, and before I get into the video, I just wanted to show you guys this. You can see I did end up changing my gamer tag to Asylum King. So finally got that all settled and done. Asylum is up, the RC is up, like I made in my video a couple days ago, but my name is finally changed, so be on the lookout for me if you see me in pubs or anything. Ah man. So, um yeah, I'm just playing some MW2 live commentary here. Didn't really get to do the full normal intro, but it's all good. Joined this game, um, played half the terminal game last game, and honestly, this lobby, it seemed decent, but some people left, you know, guys got to 1450, people were trickshot, and, you know, all that good stuff, and wow, 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 alright, thank you. I, turned on? Nope. Why are they all using pistols? Just gonna knife them. Yep. This is, that was kind of weird, it, like, there was, like, Three guys with USP 45s. They're just all chilling there and kind of. Yeah, I don't know. It seems like a lot of low levels. I don't know. It seems like there's a lot of low levels today. Maybe it's just some four guys that I've seen or something. But who knows? Anyways, the one thing I wanted to talk about today is uh, how you literally heard my gun go off. I never understand about the scene. You can literally hear your shot go off, and um, your the bullet like the other person will kill you. It's always, I don't know. Again, I, I don't know. To me, like, when you zoom in like that and the crosshairs are there, and it's it's just kind of weird to me. All right, so anyways, um, what I wanted to talk about today was um, I thought I fixed it. So, basically, the other night, I um, got up er really early. I had a lot of shit to do that day. I did everything that day. And then at night, I got home, and it was like 12.30 at night, and I was really tired. So I was like, you know, fuck it, I'm going to go to bed. My, my sleeping schedule is kind of, you know, messed up. Or, you know, this is going to be the day. I am going to fix it. It's all going to be good. I'm going to be back on a little normal schedule. It's going to... How? Every time. But it's going to help me out with, um... It's going to help me out, you know, making videos, streaming. You know, I'm going to be able to do more stuff in the day, this and that. So I went to bed about 12.30, and I woke up at like 5.30, and I'm kind of like shit I gotta like go back to sleep but I never did but you know I just kind of said I'm like okay you know what? I'm just gonna stay up all day then you know what we'll we'll go from there I'll stay up I'll just you know I'll play some COD make my video I made a video really early yesterday like 11 in the morning I'm gonna do all that then I'm gonna I'm gonna go to sleep early and it's gonna be good so that night you know, I'm streaming last night, it gets about 12.30, and, uh, 12.30, 1 o'clock, and I get tired, so you know what, I'm just kind of like, fuck it, I'm, I'm getting off, I'm gonna go to bed, you know, say goodnight, this and that, so then I'm sitting there in bed, and I'm trying to sleep, you know, I'm watching TV, I'm tired, and I can't sleep, and I'm just like, okay, you know, no big deal, I'll go, you know, grind, play Call of Duty again for a little bit, so I come back on here, I grind till about 3, 3.30, then, um, you know, I start yawning again, I start feeling tired, so I, uh, I go back, I go back, try to go to sleep, can't sleep. I ended up staying up until <laughs> like 5 in the morning and I have no clue how I did it. I mean, I slept about, I did nap from like 3 or 5 in the afternoon, but so total of 7 hours of sleep, I almost stayed up 24 hours and yeah, so basically my sleeping schedule was still fucked, which kind of disappoints me because I, re I really want to try and fix it. I mean, I guess it's a little better because sometimes I go to bed at like, I'm starting to go to bed at like 7 or 8 in the morning some days, so I guess 5 isn't the worst to kind of gotta kind of start somewhere shit you've got a triple kill nice with mp5k though so yeah though um you gotta try and start somewhere so hopefully this is like the beginning of something well can only hope but um what i wanted to talk about was last night start i came on here also another, another thing i want to talk about that was the main thing but i got on here to grind for my intro you know i'm introducing this asylum you know we're all gonna have our little own Introducing montages, just something small, nothing special, and the first game on, this happens. Watch this. Yep, I got a hit marker first game on, on Scrapyard. Now, I know that shot was nothing special, it was just a little kind of like ladder stall, you know, little barrel barrel stuff, you know, it's just something something small, it was kind of like a first game on shot, I was still warming up, I played really well the first game, so you know, ooh, let's go, I didn't think I was going to get him, oh, damn it, that would have been, been decent, right there, so yeah, I hit that, it was just, 
something little. It was like one of those shots where you hit marker it. It's, it's nothing special, but if you hit it, you know, it's decent enough to throw in a montage, something like that. So that was very sad. The only thing I ended up getting last night was this very, very small three-piece that was really not special at all. You know, just kind of like a time... What can I... Like a, a time filler, yeah. That's that's the best word for it. So the only thing I did was get a little time filler three-piece. I was about just a few seconds long. So um, I'm going to grind here again um, once this video is uploaded. So I will be streaming soon. You can come watch me grind for my um, intro to Asylum, much like last night if you were in the stream. God, I I'm enjoying sniping so much more now. I'm enjoying this game so much more now that I found my headset. This is still my first game on, so I'm really not doing well. The shot is still off. Like, I should have hit that easy. But um, actually, last night when I was um, searching around, I ended up finding my turtle beaches that I used to use. So I don't even have to use my beats anymore. I can actually use my turtle beaches now, which has actually been really... It's just different, because like, I, I only have solo beats because I got the wireless ones. So um, those only like, cover your head so well, but like the turtle beaches, they, you know, I mean, th those things sit on your head really nice, you know, and I miss them. And I did end up actually getting an old wireless player. They were kind of cheaper. It was like 70 bucks for like the X32s or whatever, because I'm going to start using those PS4 too once Remastered comes out. So then I won't have to keep switching the headset back and forth. So it's actually really, really nice. So then um, I'll have a headset. Just I just have the X12s, old wire ones here to use with my 360. Then when the PS4 comes out, the wireless ones. So everything is kind of working out, you know, it's all coming together. What the fuck? I hear him. Yep, get behind. Throw some. Yeah, there he is. Oh, Marty down. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Knife, knife, knife. Oh, damn it. I always, I always hit the button to knife and it, like, never goes through or registers or, I don't know, server lag or some shit like that. A lot of red gunners in this game, but it doesn't really feel like it, because somehow I'm still third first game on, and... This is actually a lot better than I normally play in my live comps. So like I said, the headset is helping, and I am loving it. It's been a lot of fun, but that is about it. Um, I'll keep playing until the end of this game, see maybe I can get hit a shot of something. But other than that, this has been your boy, King of them all. Please like, comment, subscribe, and until next time, I will see you guys later. Peace.